Welcome to Top Solid 7. In this video, we're going to learn how to create an enumeration and use it in a custom property. An enumeration, in simple speak, is just a list. Let's have a look. Here I'm in a library called Properties, and I'm going to right click on it and start by creating a new folder. And this new folder is going to be Web Demo. Why not? Now, in here, I'm going to go create a new document. And to begin with, I'll go to the Special tab, and I'm going to go find Enumeration and Validate. Now, the enumeration here is going to be List of Customers. Why not? You have a value and you have text. The value is just there so we have something to assign a number to. So I'm going to start at 1. Text is going to be Bob the Builder. Why not? Number 2 customer might be Mighty Ducks. Number three customer might be, whose line is it anyway? I don't know. You get the idea. You can make any type of custom listing of whatever with an enumeration. Now, from there, we're going to make a new document called a property now. And it's inside this property that we're going to create or use, I should say, the enumeration. So I'm going to call this customer. Maybe customer choice, why not? List of my customers. Now, what I need to do here is I need to go and create an enumeration parameter. So I'm going to go create an enumeration parameter, and I'm going to pull it from list of customers, the one we just created. Okay. The name here is going to be my customers. Perfect. And I'll choose my default one, Bob the Builder. And now I'll set the parameter here to my customers. I would name the property accordingly. Hit save and close. And now I can test this. So what I'm going to do is create a quick part. And I'm going to go assign this property in here. So to assign a property at the part level, I'm going to go ahead and go to my parameters. Here we see a list of all parameters in here. And we want to add a property. To do that, I'm going to go to my Construction tab, go to Parameters, come down to User Property. And here, I'm going to look for my customers. I can call it my customers here, or I can name it something unique in its use here. Now, I can set the value. Maybe I want Mighty Ducks to be my customer. And away we go. There is my custom property set to Mighty Ducks. Now, what you might use this for is for your bill of material, or you might use it for a title block, or whatever. But at the end of the day, this is how you use an enumeration and link it to a custom property and then assign it inside a part file, an assembly file at the project level, wherever you want to assign a custom property.